Hey, welcome back to the channel. So excited about the new update. This was our first multiplayer mission in 4.36. We did a 10 player cap around the border to prevent any aircraft from flying into South Korean airspace. There were quite a few SG 27s performing a cap on, in our area of responsibility. There were a few things that we noticed that may not be normal, but in the future we would do tests to make sure we could duplicate them. Hammer and Hawkeye were the F 16 flights, while Bug was the F 18 flight with two humans. Check out the description for chapters in my Aviation Plus store where all purchases directly support the channel. And make sure to go visit my channel for my other videos. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe. See ya. Two showing two contacts there. Possibly jamming them. Yep. Can't I can't. Oh, there we go. I think it's a four ship. Alright, I'm, go I'm going after the leading uh, single, then uh, two take the second leading. Alright, go on gate. Swear, I can stay a distance away. Uh, if your DVL will be loud, just in case. Yeah, it's 33. Fox 3, Bullseye 28455, uh, 20,000. Cranking left. Hawkeye 2, Fox 3, crank left. Fast, flare. Fences, Fox 1, off cold. Fast, flare. Hey, heads up. I have it's a 3 ship. Oh, scratch that. You guys just engaged with 4 ship. Yeah, it's 4-ship. We got the first two. It's yeah, so that 4-ship. All of them seem to be turning cold right now. So let's make sure you keep an eye on them. Uh, make sure if they don't turn hot and don't go too far north. Uh, you got, I got uh, Nails 27. Do you have any uh, launches up there? Because one turned hot, I believe. Yep, got visual. There's Angels 11 turning hot. Permission engaged? Yep, go for it. 1 and 2 turning back hot. Well, 1's turning back hot. 2 will delay. Pick up common line of 1. Hey, firm. Four is going gate. Make sure your jammer's on four. A four go off right. One magic. One That's nearest right, tanker copper. Five bearing three three zero. Fifteen miles. Back on channel. Thank you. Yankee. Pitbull. Hawkeye. One Target magic. Twelve thousand two seven four five one. Five uniform. Two three one eight five. Going cold. Alright, another one behind them, Bullseye 28362, 29,000, targeted. Hawkeye, 1-2, magic, 1, contact confirmed, hostile. Box 3, 28260, 28,000, Box 3. Off left. Husky cold. It seems like there's I got uh, nails 29 over there too, so it's probably another another couple 29s over there as well. All right, one is turning hot right. One, five, three, bullseye, two, six, one. Hammer, six, two, magic, one, contact confirmed, hostile. ID, make 29. Oh, he's going cold. Hawkeye, one, two, magic, one, contact confirmed, hostile. ID, make 29. To monitor a trailing group, I got the uh, leading one. It's cold. Hawkeye, one two, magic one, contact confirmed, hostile. ID to two twenty seven. 
I think there's three groups in trail. Bullseye uh, two eight two seven eight fifty two. One's cold. Two's Fox three crank left. Copy four is turning right. Two's Fox three two ship. Dude, this is four. I got vision on the two ship. You're engaging uh, support. Two's out left. Copy. Dude, this is four. Going for the rear. Bandits right now. Actually, all of them seem to be turning cold. I don't know if I want to chase after them. Hey, missile down. Box one or three? No clue. I've, I got no indications in my jet. Alright, one Hammer, is turning six, back. Two, magic. One contact confirmed hostile. Hammer, one, six, one, magic. One, contact is outlaw. Uh, Conlayer 28,000. I got friendlies mixed in there, careful. Copy, yeah, it's not AFS, I see him. I'm gonna turn cold then, if they're in there. I'm gonna distance myself. Targeted bullseye, 28056, 21,000, singleton. Rega. Hawkeye, one, two, magic, Two's one, target. contact, confirmed, hostile, ID, this is 27. Hawkeye, one, one, Fox 3, 27854, uh, 21,000, off left. Caution, caution. I think that there's two more targets behind that one. Copy that. We're going to hold, you get them. Hawkeye 1, uh, Husky off left. 1, this is 4, do you need me to turn hot? A firm, yeah, when we Fox, yeah, depending on the distance, yeah, go ahead and turn hot. Copy, turning hot. Hawkeye 2, Fox 3, Bullseye 292, 28, 12,000. Hey, 2, this is 4, you got a bandit hit through, they're engaging him right now. Coming back in hot. 2 is cold, right? Copy. 1's uh, turning back hot west. Yeah, one, recommend we uh, hold shots a little bit. They're defeating them all. All right, copy. Where's Pitbull, but he's still on you. I'm going to stay on him. He's not spiking me, so. Yep, he's going defensive. All right, I'm turning cold. All right, we'll bring the line back, so we're going to bring our uh, line of uh, defense back more south. All right, guys, a guy hot. Uh, box 3 close, 26040. 27,000. Off cold. Pitbull. Hawkeye, one two, magic. One contact confirmed hostile. ID to 227. Declare 25538, declare. Oh, it's a down 27, it's splashed. Tumbling at 37,000 feet. How's the altitude on it? On my radar, it's falling through 34,000 right now. I saw him at, I thought he hit the ground just now. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. The guy I have locked up right now. Oh, I'm, look, I'm looking in another direction. Uh, west, there's a guy, uh, bullseye 274-7128. All right, targeted. Fox three two seven three sixty nine uh, twenty two thousand. Fox five two play five. Defensive Fox one. Brian, we're gonna go tank. Husky off cold. Pitbull. One's coming back hot or two. Yeah, they definitely changed the dynamics of the AI. They're definitely smarter. Yep, that's very true. I agree with that. 
So they're defeating these missiles like left and right, so just be careful with your missiles there. Four. Is anybody targeting the 2706814? Break, break. Ray gun, ray gun, two one five five seven two three. Use your TG or if you have one, I don't know if you have one or not, but use your TGP if able. Hawkeye one's gonna check out, see if we can tank. Seems like our uh other counterpart is having problems with the tanker, and I believe we lost AWAX, but I still see him on RWR. Yeah, go ahead and rejoin. You can go ahead and turn back right. I'm turning right towards the tanker. Doing a quick ass so you guys get ahead. Three, are you over by the tanker right now? Uh, yeah, yeah, sort of. Copy, we're coming your way, see if we can tank or not. So it's interesting, there's an, there's an extra Viper trying to tank, and the tanker's like not responding. Might be one of the AIs, possibly. Or is that a human? Hawkeye 1 1, fly to 4, checking out to tanker. Yeah, I got uh, lights uh, on that one. Uh, perfect. All right. So, did you um, say you were in ready pre-contact position when you were in the area? Yes, sir. I did that, and it said Roger and responded and everything. Interesting. All right. So far, uh, bug we got Hawkeye one one is on the t boom now. Uh, we're gonna see if we can go through the uh, order and see if we, everybody else can get tank as well. Roger, as long as you guys are actually getting fuel. Yeah, it's just one of us. Every uh, three, Two of us have tried without uh, getting fuel. Only one has made it so far. What is possible? I would like to try it again because I am disappointed. Yeah, we're going to try it again. Yeah, and then two's going to do the same thing, and then I don't know, I don't know what we're going to do about three, but hopefully he doesn't call three. 2,000. But I'm worried. Call three, I can just pass it if my jet's still working. Yeah, we'll see how that works when we get there. Oh, just got into wind turbulence with that tanker. <laughs> Contact. Yeah, it's a weird finesse, like, are you able to get at least pre-contact, or are you just able to, it just didn't respond? Uh, I was able to actually connect twice, but I never got fuel. That's interesting. Brody, you on uniform? Copy that. Is that you in uh, pre-contact now? Copy that. Alright, copy. We're gonna... You should be able to do it, but we're going to go off and start heading back home. But it said that you're next, so you should be good. Yeah, I'm fine. i got enough fuel. Copy. All right, flight, we're going to climb and go over. One from two, request we go back to air-to-air -air attack hand. Uh, A-firm, uh, going back to air-to-air. -air. All right, four, go ahead and break in three. Or, like, four in the flight. Three, two... One break. Four break. Wait about five, ten seconds or so. Copy that. Keep it at 300. Four breaking. Two is breaking.
One's a break. Heads up, I switched before. I am taking right side of two seven right. So sit an active right, I'll take left. Hawkeye, one, Osan Tower, wing, two, two, zero, at eight knots, runway two, seven, right, cleared for landing, check gear down. Something Landing on left side. Going around. Hawkeye, 1-1, one, one. go around, Vector, zero, 080, zero. contact approach for resequencing. Altitude, altitude. Alright, good enough. Nice flyby. <laughs> yes. Hammer, 6-1, Osan Tower, next time get clearance before landing. Nice. Onto Angels Three. Yeah, Angels Three. That's really insane. Just not it, nose diving to that. <laughs> yeah. Well, when I followed it down, it was it was 450 knots doing 4G turns, 3,000 feet off the deck. Yeah, I like. Uh, I was the only one who got a hit, and I didn't get the kill. So oh, you didn't. You yeah. The only one. Yeah. You. Uh, Regan. <laughs> Craig only want the kill. <laughs> I'm the only one with the kill, thank you, and I fucking hunted that 27 yeah. down. They, I don't know where... Did you guys not hear me on Uniform 6 screaming, like, is anybody targeting this guy? Anybody? Yeah, because no, we, we weren't. Heard you. That's well, no, but I, I ne but I never heard a response. I never once. I transmitted four times. I heard complete silence from you guys. Like, well, I never even... fair, I, we didn't know who, what flight you were talking to. And on top of that, I mean, we didn't have eyes. Well, I, okay. I, 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 because I, if, I guess you don't need a negative response. I guess you have to assume that no one is if they don't respond. Like, I mean, you, otherwise you, you're gonna get thirty people saying negative on the radio. Yeah, so well, it's like, right? No, no. But I was looking for one. Well, because I had just come off tanker and this guy popped off my nose. I didn't know where any of you guys were at on data link. So like, nobody is responding at all. And it's like, I don't know. Well, what well the did, did you hear on. us talking? While did you hear no. us? At all? No, no, I didn't. Nothing. I couldn't hear anything. Okay. I, was, like, I heard you, but I was looking and I was trying to find the target, but I, since I couldn't find it, I, I didn't want to say anything to, uh, you know, conflict, uh, jump into the. Uh, uh, you're good. It's just I literally didn't hear a single word um, at all on Uniform 6. Oh, so it, just... it gets worse than that, man. Um, <laughs> we were on it. Hold up. Hold up. You call out, you're hunting down a MiG-29 because you have a 29 on your RWR? It was I'm seven. clean. Oh, well, that's... I'm weird. clean. Can someone upload that tech fee so I can look at myself? Yeah, I'll, I'll upload it. So, with that being said, um, they've changed the field of view of radars. So, if you're locked onto somebody, Spike or uh, STT, it's going to narrow that field of view. So, the other people might not get you on, like, nails. Um, so, uh, we were actually in the process of tanking, so... <laughs> oh, then I don't know, then. I'm connected when he's talking about fucking the Su-27. So, every single one of my shots missed. The only person, like we said, was old Craig that got a hit. I shot one at our pie, he still got away from it. To be fair, he did turn off... Just about, jeez, I'm trying to see R what what Rippy these or what these are RTR. Doing. Wait a minute, RTR. Sore at me, huh? If this even tracked, yeah, it's tracking. All right. This one seemed like it tried to track. So, uh, w w did you, Shane? Do you remember shooting? If did you shoot an STT or Sam or STWS? Do you remember? 
Uh, say that again. Do you remember if you shot in STT or SAM mode or TWS uh, mode? I was in TWS. Okay, that's another thing they changed. If you shoot in TWS, it's probably not going to hit. Oh, well, that would have been good to know. Yeah. I was using TWS the whole time. Yep, that's one of the changes. See, see, I, I did STT. So you have to use STT now. Huh. It, it, you don't well, have how do you to. Shoot, how do you shoot two then? Yeah, cause that's that's another. Yeah, yeah, I don't. I guess you don't. I don't. I haven't tried it yet. But why? Why did they nerf TWS? Huh? Why did they make it worse? I don't know why they made it worse, but that's something they changed. It's probably more realistic. I, I don't know. What I mean, it is. yeah. I mean, nobody uses TWS in the real jet, but you can also shoot two in CRM in the real jet. So yeah, it'll still yeah, it'll still uh. But maybe if you s if you. SAM mode, but only two targets. Maybe that's better than TWS two targets. Yeah, I'll try it next time. Yeah, so just Sorry. keep that in mind. I pause it. Yep. So that missile's tracking. Yeah, it's it tracking. Like all their invasions are just going cold and full going burner. Which is, I mean, a human would do the same thing. Fair enough. Yeah. So it's they're a lot more uh, intelligent. I tested uh, ST. I'm sorry, uh, TWS against uh, what, some IL-28s, like six IL-28s, and uh -huh. it hit like four of them. So a non-maneuvering target. Exactly. Okay. But yeah, we set up a real nice grinder here. It was actually really good. So this cools. Uh, he was like, "There's a guy hot." I'm like, "Get the hot guy." Jeez, look at this Thunderbird style. <laughs> oh my god. Come back. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's that is someone I don't want to mess with right there. <laughs> Look at that Emelman he just did. Yeah. Geez. I know, right? <laughs> anyway, so I shoot my missile and I turn cold. Yep, you turn cold. Seems like it tracked. That's what it seems like it did. Yeah, it tracks. Dies really, really fast. Shoot it at you. Yeah, Mach shot 1. At the bottom bandit, the one that was hot, like closest. Maka point eight seven. So he turns cold. Let me see when he starts defending. Eight nine miles. It sounds about the bullseye. Or not bullseye. Pit bull range ish. I have a newbie question. Go ahead. You fired the missile and SDT, and then you like did a a turn like you did a one eighty. Do you not have to support the missile from the aircraft with your radar? Uh, I usually support it, especially if 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 it's a human. I usually support it till husky. I usually don't support it all the way to Pipple. Because okay. Husky is like four or five second difference depending on your parameters. But usually that four or five seconds could, could uh yeah, he, he didn't really uh well you're at fourteen miles, so that you might not have needed to support it for that yeah. too long. So that's probably that's I, good. I, that's why I tried to turn cold as soon as I shot because I, yeah, I, I did not low. set a Mar today. Usually Mar uh I have before four three five, Mar is usually like eighteen or something. He straight out ran it though. Yeah, he completely. All of them did. I shot one at. I think I was at like twelve miles in single target, and it still didn't get a hit. Yeah, I shot. Uh, I think twice. I think you shot a missile at me here. I think that's when I think I get an M. I don't remember. The hawk. Get him. Smack him. Oh. Get him. Yeah, that's nice. right. Came too far close, <laughs> sucker. That's when I didn't shoot that time. Had chain. Went after. Whoa. Interesting. So you, you, did you, you TWS probably most of your targets there, chain? Yeah. I oh. had full SA on okay. basically all four of these guys. Yeah, this one tracked, so it's possible. So he TWS and it still at least went in that direction. And there's, yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff coming at you. 27 is a 77. A uh, roadie. Do you no. re do you remember this position right here? Do you remember this? Yeah. So did you get a missile warning? Yes, I did. You got a Fox One or a active radar, homie? No, it's a. Uh, I believe it was a radar. Okay. I saw my so RWR. Probably got this one here. Yep. Oh, well, maybe, maybe this one. A, that might be at the same target there, possibly. But that's another 
Oh, that's hammer. That's another thing to change with the F field of view. So one person might be getting uh, locked on by a missile, and they're in the field of view, like 10 degrees, arbitrary number. And then someone else is over here, they won't get that missile warning because of the, the field of view of the missile. Oh, that's cool. That's something else they, they changed a little bit there. You know, I defeated, I defeated about... Freaking lines everywhere. Two. Yep. So we're clean. Whoa, that's the guy you saw. I think. Yeah, I told you I saw somebody, yeah, tumbling at like 30,000 feet. Interesting. So that was the Hawk set at work. Oh. Huh. Yeah, at this point, I told Hammer uh, 3 to go to steer point 6. And I expected him to cover that area. Well, uh, one and two went into this. I mean, you could probably see me over there, don't you? Hey, hey, guys, shooting missiles at and like dodging missiles is really interesting. And everything, but if we can get to where I fly to the tanker, that'd be more interesting for me. Okay, yeah, sorry, it's we're no, no, a I'm lot kidding. of stuff to talk I'm about. No, I'm joking. Oh, <laughs> yeah, Rody, yeah, Rody, I did go to step point six to cover the area. You can no, see this me is also. This is way more interesting than what I did. So, <laughs> Jesus, yeah, I feel like Coxite did literally all the work. Because, <laughs> thank you, Coxite. Yeah, because I right. Goodness. If he shot anything, oh, we'd yeah, have probably been dead. One, this is the one where he was going after number two. If I remember. Oh, I remember. Somewhat remember that no, not position. There's chain. So you thought it was going after chain? Yeah. Hot I think on so, chain. Yeah. No, when I was turning hot, I think it was going after chain. So, I don't know. Let's see when I turn hot. Let's see if it was going after chain. Let me fast forward a little bit. It might... No, it's definitely not that. I remember shooting that because I saw him. He was really close. I think that was when we noticed that they were just defending missiles like it's nothing. And we oh, started yeah. to push south or pull south to kind of get south, more south. And this guy was super close and going Mach one and a half. And I'm like, this is not okay. So I yep, foxed I on him and he this. went cold. Yeah. And he probably defeated it. Classic. Yeah, thanks for that, by the way. Man. Yeah, you really love that tactic. <laughs> but if it works, who am I to judge? What was my speed? 0.89? That's fair. Yeah, here I was like right on the edge of RTR. Oh, it it sounds it. like. We had to get a little bit closer. Yeah, a little why, bit did it, why did it keep? Yeah, why did it turn out like that? Because it's trying to pull lead, and it's like a unlimited amount of lead, and it's like freaking out. Like the ge the geometrics is yeah. like cannot divide by zero, and it's like mm. I can't pull lead. Can't get enough speed to pull lead. Pulling uh, two G's. I feel that looks a little bit different than three five. It is. That's, I've never seen AI do this, so that's number one. I've never really seen this exact position here. You start defending. Yeah, start. let's figure out where the missile leaves the rail. Yeah, okay. So I shoot at 10 miles. <laughs> Stop it. Box at 13 miles, but probably... Pretty closely uh, off the rail, Pitbull. Goodness. It that's... should still be. Well, that's weird, dude. Like, I don't like that. I don't no, know. that should have hit. Crazy. Yeah, that, sh that should have hit. Because that should have pulled. It should have realized that it was. The jet was kept the same. But what would it. Heading. What would it do? Like, it, it. I mean, it's still got thrust, though. Right? Yeah. I don't yeah. know how long has it been. Did it lost track? It was forty one seconds. Did it lose track? Well, he was he's in the he's in the beam basically when that missile's looking for him. So it yeah. may have just never saw him and just took the last telemetry that your jet gave it and was following that. The and launch. just never actually got a skin paint. Fifty two or forty two, so that's ten that's eleven seconds there. I'm pretty sure that I, I don't remember what it was in the game. I think it's ten or something. I don't know. Yeah, but he's not He's off of 90 it? from it, though. What is the missile supposed warm. to go active? 
it usually goes active mm -hmm. around nine, nine miles. So off the rail, it was probably active pretty closely off the rail. So I should have gone active about right there and straight in, but no. It's trying to pull lead. It doesn't do pure. Pure's not going to work. No, yeah. Yeah, but look at where it's... It's well, just well, right here, it, it loses lock completely. It can't... It's just kind of... Yeah, now it's being at this that. point. Goodness. I guess it could have continued. Mm -hmm. It should have... I think weird. it should have continued, right? Instead of losing Instead it. Instead of... Pull, yeah. I don't know. Pulling out like that. That's weird. 4,000 feet away. It's pretty... And then pulled off. Like at the... At this point, I should have continued. I feel like, and yes. hoped. Well, and hope. Look to how see fast it. he's going. He's going the same speed, uh, relatively the same speed as the missile. So I guess that that makes sense. So it can't pull lead off of something that's going just about the same speed as it. Yeah, but it still should be locked onto him, right? Oh. And following him it doesn't know. matter. Yeah, the fact that it just continues that arc that is what seems because like you can see exactly. it only there and then now it's not yeah the it's arc just... the the continued arc is what's throwing me off yeah, yeah. okay at 2 11 19 on the timestamp or 21 11 19. are you taking notes for the devs yeah i'm taking a whole bunch of notes recording recorded this whole entire thing nice work. all right that's interesting that is very interesting whoa Was this AI? Yeah. This okay. Hammer. Hammer four. That's a that's an eighteen. Wait, hold on. No, it's a sixteen. I gotta look at my notes. A bug was bug was uh the eighteen. Hey, Rody basically did a pop quiz. Do you know what this is called, Rody? When you shoot and then you keep going, do you know what that's called? BVR tactic wise, uh, when I shot it and uh, and you he... turn back hot, you know what that's called? Oh, I'm just uh, going back hot, my friend. Okay, <laughs> well, it's called it's called bonsai. It's a type of tactic. Oh yeah, I got it. I got it. Well, where? I said it. No, no, no. I'm saying I got oh, I got the Jesus. answer. I got the answer to the pop quiz. Oh, okay. I said, is that a bonsai? Oh yes, <laughs> then yes, you are correct. No, I. Started chasing him because I had him on my uh, TGP. What in but the then world all of a sudden, nothing weird, huh? That is like a humanoid motion. There. Yeah, it is. And he whipped. Yeah, he did. He rolled over and pulled G the other direction. That's awesome. That's like I'm still locked. That's like I don't. I'm clean. I'm clean. I'm clean. I'm clean. And I'm not clean, and like off the other direction. That's ooh, insane. that was fast, dude. That was very fast. Jeez, was that turn? It's scary. Yeah. Ooh. So, are these uh, jets? What's the um, the threat on these jets? So, like what... I need to look at it, but I, I didn't change anything. S Wait, they're ace. They're ace. Yeah, they are ace. Okay. I believe. I'll, if if they're not ace, I'll post it and ping everyone and make sure you know. Did you upload it? That okay. uh, I think that was the the NATO hawk. Yeah. Oh, I didn't see. Well, that. actually, okay. let's go back. Go back. Back. Go back. Go back. Yes. Yeah, I see the missile. It just didn't highlight. All right. And this this is when I saw I saw something close. I saw two. I saw your data too. Like right here. I, oh, I saw your data. And then I was looking at him, declared him, looked over the TGP, and saw him tumbling. This yeah, and this one, this one, I saw you guys coming in, and we were going cold. Uh, Viper. So, for this whole section of the flight, I go had... and look at like my two o'clock high tumbling at like thirty-five thousand. Oh, that's what I was seeing in my T flare. It was weird. Ooh. You guys should look at what the tanker was doing. <laughs> you know, I wonder what happened to our AWACS, because at some point we didn't get it landed. from AWACS. I, I, landed. I, I, okay. I believe I called it on uniform. Yeah, AWACS was landing with the uh, with the tanker. 
the first tanker. Because I landed, I landed first, and um, but we'll go over it later. But yeah, uh, yeah, this guy just went to space, and he got shot in space. Hmm. So, like for this whole section, His altitude there? We, we didn't have anything, or I didn't have anything on IDM. I had the other flight leads, but uh -huh. not Rody. So, uh, by default, I think I've noticed it puts everyone in your flight. And the flight leads of the other, other flights in your package. That's what it puts in IDM by default. I I had to plug them in, but I and I was seeing them displayed uh -huh. on my HSD. I saw two one and three one, but I did not see Rody or three. Uh, Rody should have been whatever he was. Uh, one one. Yeah. Oh, one one. Yeah. I did not see him. Like okay. I had to recycle it in order to like. So we started back towards the tanker, and I asked for his bulls, and that's when I like recycled it, and it came back on. Okay, I've seen that bug in three five. You have to recycle your data link for sometimes. All right, data link sometimes, but someone was in continuous. No, it yeah, wasn't someone mine. was. I believe was. I saw. I believe I saw two one three one, but I did not see one one. No, I was on demand all the time. Oh wait, wait, wait. hold on a second. I meant, I meant, yeah, I I set continuous, so I meant my bad if that's not what you guys want. Two one two three, and uh, I don't think I saw two 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 three. Well, because they could, they were uh, F eighteens, I think, right? Yes. And they should be. They should come up on the uh, IDM still. The guy just doesn't want. To... Go to the. Yeah, we can yeah. probably debrief this for five hours, but I'll go through it quickly here. Yeah, I'm fine if you go quickly for my section. And then I'll I'll up I'll upload it to here so everybody can see. It's the first engagement. Yeah. Rody, where's Rody? Go. <laughs> yeah. Did, oh. I sent. Yeah. yeah. First engagement. Okay. First engagement. I sent uh, to confirm. I sent three to step point six to cover that area. And you and I would try then. So, uh, the, uh, three was an AI or three was a human? Was a human. Me. Okay. Me. I was AI. Brian, okay. Cool. I, did go more, I did go more north. And that, I started turning. This. Oh. Thanks. Hammer 6 2 was like, I'm getting out of here. Jesus. I'm I mean, done. To be fair, there's two missiles after him. I don't yeah, believe. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I see well, the two missiles. Jesus. <laughs> man. I I died quick the last Three, time. So. Four. Four missiles. Wow. Four missiles coming towards him. I mean, not directly at him, but towards him. Towards him. All right. That was a uh, crazy. So they're all cold. Reset. Hawkeye's in. We're here. Brody is yeah, back um, hot. Back in hot. Uh, one or two, they're too far away. Yeah, and... three over. He went to go tank. It seems like. Yeah. 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 Well, I'm sorry. This is where around the area. I don't have idea. Error, right? I don't know how you had that error. Like five thousand pounds is weird. Yeah, that was weird. That's yeah. another thing. Yeah. Yeah, because uh, I oh, wait. Someone else had it, other than so we had one person with started with five thousand pounds. Someone else had five thousand pounds on startup. Well, so I, I no, I started on the on the ground with six point nine. Okay. Uh, I confirmed it in the uh, cockpit video. Oh, so it's it's not just you, Ryan. <laughs> so there was two people. Okay, who shot that one? A, a roll back a little bit. No, no I, I started. Hawk shot. Oh, I started. Hawk, it. It. Right here. 
No, left. No, no, no. It's underneath Rhodey's. Yeah, it's right next to me. Oh. Yeah, this right one. There. Yeah. Oh. yeah. yeah okay, cool. One. So what the uh what that means as far as gas, um, the bags weren't full, they were empty on startup. Basically, right? Yeah, basically, so, yeah, six nine. Good question. So would a hot pit refueling fix that? Yes. Mm-hmm. But it no, should it, no, it will not. In this bug, we've seen you can hot pit refuel all you want. Your starting load sixty nine hundred, unless you can get to a tanker, and if it allows you to go over sixty nine or seventy two, the basic. They're so basically set. spawning with bags physically, but no bags. Exactly. Interesting. Kind of what it wow. looks. Like. I, I had the same thought whether whether I could land in hot hot pit refuel. So okay. I don't know this if. Is... I don't know if landing changes the equation. Yeah, it but... does. I think it does because I landed and I uh, did a hot pit refuel. And it took you up to 12, 12 uh, to 11, yep. 9 area? Definitely. And that's when I came back up and I rejoined you guys. Wait, so who are the two that started with less gas? It was me and who else? Rody? I think Ryan? No. No, no, it was not me. I started with full tank. Oh. I had 11,000 yeah. pounds or something like that. So who was the other person? I just heard someone say I had... Yeah, we yeah. had... It's two we people! Who? Who? Who are you? We lost all their fuel mid-flight when we took off and we figured it out. It's in our flight. You, we, so far, you know, There's number like three at a wave off six. and go to the tank. Someone, someone has left the Discord like like 10 minutes ago, five there's minutes no, ago. No, there's oh. not, there's nine, there's still nine people here. Uh, I had a noise there. I'm confused. <laughs> no, 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 that, that would have been Rogue Lee that left the Discord. So, who's here that wasn't here? What is happening? I don't know, man. Yeah, uh, I like I said, well. disclaimer. I I told you, I knew it. It was gonna be insane. Everybody following the tanker down. <laughs> I knew it. I called shenanigans. So, prime, go go back. And oh, to the see tanker what, guy. Yeah, yeah. Let's see what happens. So, I split at some point because I got happening. I mean, I could have continued with the flight, but I was more interested in figuring out why. So, like, oh. Okay, so we might have had a broken tanker. So we're there, and we have one AI with us. Three it's human just like way in. late, though, in the game. Yeah. Because these dudes are refueling. Bug, bug, what is it? Bug 5 is... Yeah, or Bug 5. Is uh, refueling for, like, what seems like 20 minutes. They're attempting to refuel, and I'm I'm there with them. Um, And then not... this dude starts going defensive, the... The copper four one starts going defensive. Yeah, in right. the like up up at like twenty five thousand. He's oh, pulling yeah. like three G's. I don't, I don't think the tankers are rated for that. And then he, no. and no, then he hits the point, deck, and we're all trying to find him, and we're like, "What the hell's going on?" <laughs> no, at this so, point, I knew the tanker was wasn't gonna refuel, so uh, I told my flight to uh, come into. Uh, Land. So, Prime, in the interest of uh, giving the dev something to work on, um, uh, let's see. When I, I'll have to look at the tape. But when I was ingressing on the tanker, you, so Prime, you passed me the um, AWACS on Data Link. Okay. And and we thought it was the tanker. No, right. no problem. No problem there, right? No problem there. That was just a misidentification. Um, I find the tanker. It tells me six three Yankee for air to air tank in. Oh yeah, that was all messed up too. Yep. Yep. So I'm I'm trying to find this dude, and he's I'm tr- I'm tracking one one dude, and. I'm like 380 knots or something, and he's gaining like uh, distance from me on the tack end. So I'm like, okay, that can't be the right dude. So then I call, I figure out how to call like, what is it, uniform uh, vector to tanker. So it sends yeah. me to the other the other tanker. 
and I'll I'll have to go back and watch my uh, complete video to give you proper notes. But the air to air tech in was jacked, and the um the frequencies were a little bit jacked too. Yo, yeah, the air to air because I went to six two Yankee, and I had my tech in was fine, and everybody else had either a six, random three. number or zero. It was 6-2. It literally said 6-2, and I went to 6-2, so, and it matched my FCR distance. So when I did 6-2 Yankee, I had uh, I had a uh, no yard stick. Right there. Yeah, same here, but when I had a 6-2 Yankee, that's when I had that right yard stick. So. Bingo. Yep. So, Prime, you got that? So you're, you're the only one that had 6-2 Yankee, and everybody else had 6-3 Yankee. Huh. But interestingly enough, that was the second tanker, I think. So the first tanker was still 6-3 Yankee, and it was sending me to the wrong tanker. So there was some weirdness happening. But I ended up with um, Bug Flight on... Um, what the hell was the tanker's call sign? It was Copper 4 and 5. Copper, yeah, Copper 4 was the first one. 5 was the second one. So yeah. with that... No, we'll, Copper we'll... 4. Copper 4, uh, while well, I was hot pit refueling... Copper four just uh, lined up right next to me. Yeah, we just watched that. And as soon as I took off, I called over uniform that eight wax was coming Wait. in for a landing. Hold on a second. Pause. This is four. This is this is copper. Hawkeye so screwing up. You paused at the worst time for me. <laughs> no, no, this is Hawkeye four. Yeah, it's, it is. Yeah. No, no. So, so check it right. <clears throat> oh, okay. So the whole flight's here. This is not what I'm yeah. thinking about. I'm thinking about something that happened minutes ago. So I'll explain the scenario, right? So I screw up, right? So I reset. I try to line up. I go into pre-contact. I wasn't getting any lights at all whatsoever for whatever reason. So I had Prime here just, you know, telling me to go up. And no, I heard that. pretty much yep. my boom operator. Yep, I heard that. Yep. And then I just gave up and, you know, I said I'm done refueling and... It went to one one. Yeah. So this is like way after. Like I, I heard this on Victor. Um, I was like, "Hey, dudes, I'm out. I gotta go to an airport because I got 900 pounds of fuel." Um, but minutes before this, maybe 10 minutes or so, I want to say I, I dipped out at that point. Um, but a Viper joined. Uh, Bug was um. Bug was trying to figure out what was wrong with the tanker, and I joined Bug because I didn't have any um, gas. Yeah. And we were trying to figure out what was going on, but a viper showed up, just a random viper, and we didn't know who it was. Oh, that oh, could it have was been an F fifteen. It wasn't even a viper; it was an F fifteen, actually. No, it was not an F fifteen. There was a single tail. Really? That could have been me. I thought Paper. it was Lee that came in and he you know, scared us all. <laughs> <clears throat> nope, there was a single tail. I saw him, and he was like trying to connect to the tanker. So that, I don't know how. Not, not this tanker, but the one that just like oh, the one landed from before. Yeah, yeah, that was me because you were trying to call me on the frequency. My VC was really quiet. Sorry, I saw you guys. I, you were there for like a couple minutes, then you like dipped off, and I kept trying to tank with it. Okay, so if that was a human, that's fine. Yeah, I'm okay with that, but if it was an AI that just like went rogue and decided to Yeah, that's me, yeah. That's it was me. Yep. What is that me behind him? Yes, yeah, it's gum. Or no, I'm out there, yeah. So I'm looking at this dude, I'm like, where the hell did this guy come from and why isn't he uh, calling anything? Yeah, cuz I'm brand new and my IVC was super quiet for some reason. Gotcha. I couldn't even hear my own flight. It was a nightmare. Yep. Okay. All right. All right. That's cool. Right, that, that's that's not a bug. That's a feature. The, a feature of flying with humans. It was a human bug. Don't worry. Yeah. Yeah. Human bug. A human bug. My favorite bug. Okay. Most dangerous bug. Uh. Yeah. There's a whole bunch of problems. Uh. So I know BMS doesn't particularly like two tankers, but in three five it was a little bit more smoother than this. So if we try this again, I'll get rid of one tanker, and then see how sure. that goes. Yeah, yeah. Because it should be fine with two tankers. Like I don't see why. Yeah. It's a pro and they're in, yeah. They're in different packages. Like they're in three different packages: tanker, two tankers, and a wax in three different packages. I don't see a problem. 
Yeah, our tanker went stupid, obviously. He was going defensive for F-18s, and then he decided to enter a right-hand turn that did not... Now, I have he, a question. If, if the tanker was in our package, would this issue occur? I, Is it even possible I, to have I, a tanker in the same package? I rarely put them in the package, because it makes it, it, it makes it really weird. Because if, if you put them all in different packages, everybody gets a different Uniform 6. So if you put a tanker in your package, your Uniform 6 will be the tanker's Uniform 6, and you talking to AWACS might talk to tanker. Like, it's really strange. Oh. I just, that's why I have them in completely different packages. I don't okay, know if I it see. was said before yet, but uh, on the first tanker, uh, Bugs number two was an AI, and as he was trying to connect, the AI was trying to connect, uh, Lee sent him home, so I don't know if that introduced a bug with the first tanker as well. Oh, so this bug, bug, the bug created a bug? I mean, I, I would believe so, because as soon as he did, uh, yeah. the uh, number two said Roger, but stayed in formation like he was trying to connect. The damn tanker sucked in its its bags, or its 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 baskets, so it, it acted like it wasn't uh, tanking. And then it started doing defensive maneuvers soon after that, and that could have been because of proximity to red air coming in, I don't know, but... Uh, yeah, there's no one. That's what I thought it was, too. That's why I thought the AWACS bugged out, because there was lost the uh, range for air to ground. Yeah, I thought the tanker got hit, because I just stopped hearing him. The AWACS went to land at like the same time as the first yeah. tanker. They landed within like a minute of each other. See if they dove at the same time. Where you at? Come on. Oh, a little off. <laughs> yeah, when I was taking off, I saw the AWACS coming in. I'll check the timing on them, but I mean, one taker. Usually, by default, it puts them at like five hours for orbit. So there's no reason for them to go home in the middle of everything. Oof, man. So, um, yeah. Any other, um, anything else? Let me save this and, and continue talking. Save as. Just the landings. Well, the, the, the carrier yes, beached the itself and stopped, stopped moving. There was that. The carrier beached itself? Yeah, it was, oh. it was right next to land and, and not moving. The whole carrier oh. group was standing still. <laughs> yeah. oh. That's hilarious. <laughs> hey, at least it was easier for you F-15s to land. <laughs> They're not moving. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I hear a call up on radio. Uh, The carrier beached itself. It's not moving. And like, I'm like, what are you talking about? <laughs> I had to scroll in to find it. It's like, oh my god. Oh yeah, another thing. The tanker was in a, comp a right turn the entire time. So we were, we were in a right turn for like an hour. Yeah, no, I was watching your stream. I mean, hey, I take that as a good opportunity to practice. That's what I saw it as. Yeah, that, that's, <laughs> that did. That was a good opportunity to practice. It was di more difficult. I did have a little bit of trouble uh, getting on there, but I was able to get on. There. All of us were able to get on there, so that's good. Yeah, as soon as I got the lights, that's when I feel comfortable and you know able to adjust. <laughs> yeah, you told me to break off and we go home. Yeah, so we we did we did a little bit of that, and then I uh, acquired. Uh, a hammer. So he comes and get on the left side here. So what I should have done, I should have kept you. I don't know. I should have kept you uh, left echelon, echelon left until I got got there and turned right. But I was in a slight right turn to get us corrected, and it worked out okay. Get us uh, down the runway. I was in a slight like three and a half degree right turn. And it got us over the runway pretty well. Oh yeah, that was definitely a good approach. I mean, <laughs> sorry for my wiggliness though. It's just wobbing and weaving. You know, oh no, as long I haven't done this in age. As long as you don't crash into anybody, it's good. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. So I, I, mean, noticed... I wasn't the most stable either. So oh, you you were you were good. So I I see there was like 100% confusion on this breakaway here. So on the breakaway, it was all good until we had to turn back, not turn back, but go on, on a final. So outside, turns, turns, breaks, breaks, and then we're supposed to... Oh, goodness. So I Yeah, my that was bad. It wasn't even parallel. I thought it was. It looked like it was. It was not. So Rody got in front. I didn't know this. I didn't know Rody got in front. So so Rody got in front. Yeah, I got... yeah, he was number four. Yeah. Oh. 
So oh, when he man. broke, I was looking at him. It's like, oh, when is he turning to final? He didn't. So I was like, you know what? I guess I'll turn to final. I just screw up the whole order. No, that's because I uh, I asked. I don't see anybody. What's happening? Cause, cause you're the and then all of a sudden, I just turn into final. Yeah, because you're the first one to break. So you gotta, you're gotta, you the guy to have visual and come back in and create the final. I don't know why I decided to turn early. I think we all did. <laughs> yeah, we all three just. Yeah, kind of just. Yeah, I just yeah. didn't know where he was going. I was like, "Fuck it, I'm landing." Yeah, and I was like, yeah, "I'll just, just extend," me. and I'll just figure it out. Yeah, I'm so glad he extended because I, 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 I saw, I saw all of you. I'm like, off, this, right? this is a. Uh, yeah, this, this is a nerve CP for disaster. I kind of felt that in the back of my head, which is why yeah, I was constantly repeating, perfect. "I'm sticking on and the left it's... side. I'm going to land on the left side. Actually, right side." And then I switch sides because someone said right. But yeah, I tried to clear off the runway as oh god. So, uh, Rody, what happened there, buddy? Oh, I think uh, there was uh, there was something wrong with my landing gear as soon as I touched down. Yeah, and it just started sliding. Ah. Uh, okay. Yeah, I was I was like a mile or something, two miles, and then I saw explosions and someone called a radio help, and then I was like, oh, oh okay. So I switched runways. And then I, you, I saw you get on the runway there. I'm like, all right, I'm just going to go around. This is weird. And then the flyby. Yeah, I was <laughs> I like, to... And then came back and landed. I didn't, even know that ha I didn't even see the explosion or anything. I was just busy take, taxing off, you know, trying to get out of your way. See, that's, that's the thing. Even uh, two and three, when we first landed, uh, something happened. Because I, I think uh, they increased the... Uh, What's the rate yeah. of descent? How do you know the rate of descent? What does it say? I think I could uh, pull that up. Uh, yeah, we both crashed. Two and two and three, we we both crashed as well. Yeah, because like your AOA attack. seems perfectly fine. So it's four ninety. Your for speed's one sixty. Okay. Five hundred. Five hundred rate of descent. It should be okay. Probably let's not see. for the landing gear. <laughs> let's uh, let's compare. Seven. Not much heavier. We'll see the Six. plea there, I so guess. It's about oh, well, when I hit, did I touch the ground yet? Jesus, I don't know what's happening. Well, that's when I went around. Duh. Go around. Oh. Go on touchdown. Four, three. Yeah, it's about two or something. Yeah, I'd say 200, 250. I don't think five would collapse. I don't know. I don't really have a reference, but I don't think five would collapse your landing gear. It shouldn't. I mean, maybe it was the weight. I mean, we did still have our tanks and everything. Possibly. Rody, you remember I how much fuel I had when you landed? I had about uh, 4,000 pounds. Yeah, I should have been fine. Yeah, Rody, my approach was the exact same as yours, and I blew up as well. I, I think it's bad luck. Too. Well, I don't know, maybe I had a higher G-Force landing or something. Did either of you record I didn't it blow or... up. It just slided, and that's when I called on turning everything off because I didn't want it to explode, so I turned the uh, fuel flow, I turned everything off. Uh, and I got out. Yeah, I didn't really explode. Like something broke. I don't know. I ejected, but my, I think my landing gear. Yeah, like, you broke. see, the AOE is like fine. Like he's level. Like his left yeah. landing gear wasn't deployed or something. Like he touched and then he just ghosted the left yeah. side. Did you, uh, did you happen to look? Make sure you had three green. Yeah, I had three green. Okay. Hey, can you look at my landing? Something Interestingly enough, when I landed, uh, I. Th thought there's no reason my landing gear should not have deployed i was pretty slow when i deployed it and my nose wheel did not deploy so i scraped the nose Where'd you land? I, I landed at the uh home plate as far as me but did you watch the hammer 6-3 landing as well the what hammer 6-3 no, I I got out of there because my nose scraped. I know, I'm trying to see what's wrong with my land. What happened with my land? Hey, 
Oh, you Prime, want to you walk. don't you don't normally kick number four out first, do you? No, not normally. No. Okay. That was the first time I, I did. It worked out better for for that. Yeah, I think just in general, it's probably a bad idea because number four is usually your least experienced, and then plus all three of us have done nothing but look at you for the last fifteen minutes. So we have no essay on the airfield. Uh huh. Whereas if you're the only one that's able to look outside and like know where you're at. So if you break first, then in all, like, worst case, Ontario, Rody can just turn and follow who's in front of him Makes and know sense. where he's going so he doesn't keep driving like that. Is What was your call sign, uh, Ryan? Hammer, Hammer 6-3. I landed with, like just behind the tanker, basically, if you remember when that happened. Okay. All so the way back it's one, here. two, four, and then... Whoever is not in our flight. Yeah, I followed this this tanker into land. Yeah, crosswind was uh. It was mad. A yeah, it was mad. There. Oddly enough, I didn't feel it too much. I mean, I definitely felt it, but it didn't feel super strong. You know, it was, it was coming from the left, right? Yes. Yeah. It kind of did the same same type of thing here. Left side. I thought it was it wasn't too bad in the flare, so I don't know what that. Yeah, happened. you landed with like a hundred, like it was two two hundred something. Oh, my angle of attack was good as well, but I just slid off the runway. My landing gear like uh, collapsed or something. Yeah, my first, got hammered too. My first landing was was good. Second one was horrible. Hammer two. Did you land after him or before him? Just a little yeah. bit before him. He landed before me. Okay, so you, you did land once, Rody. All right, all right. So remember what TBT last update that would it would do that. Oh, Rody, what if you landed hard in that first landing? So when you took off and landed again, the landing gear just decided not to work. I don't know. Exactly. But it seems like Your a landing, hard, like, hard landing. Vertical like, uh, speed. Yeah, G1.7, that'll collapse the landing gear. Yeah, yeah, 1,200 or 1,100 descent. More what I'm looking at is as I came through the turn, I couldn't get below 190 knots. So I had to chop the throttle, which is why I know what, that I hit the ground hard. I was just, as I'm coming through this turn here, I'm at 190 knots, boards are all the way out, and like I'm at like 30 or 40% throttle. And I just cannot get the airspeed down. Mm, you're only pulling like one and a half Gs the whole way. Well, two at the beginning. Oh, I've, I don't know if it was me, but I noticed the brakes work better. Yeah. I don't know if it was just me. And I've noticed it's maybe a little bit more powerful on the engine side on takeoff. I think. I don't know. It might might just be me. I wasn't particularly concentrating on that, but next time I'll concentrate Cause, cause on that. I wasn't really thinking about that. Because I, I noticed six... I was just going like super fast on the <clears throat> climb out. Hammer 6 is vertical speed is very... Yeah, it's like 12 or 11. Well, and he landed with like a G-force of like 1.7, which will break the landing gear. Yeah, did I damage my my gear on the first landing? I hit a fence. Maybe I don't know. But I don't landing, remember seeing a fence. That was a fence. But the perimeter of the uh, airfield is a, is a fence. Oh, okay. It's like, I think it's like, if this was the actual runway, it would, it would be like around here. Mm, okay. It was pretty low. Yeah, I was low. And to be honest, I touched, uh, I touched down right on the arrows on the first one right there. Yeah, but everything was fine. Yeah. 
Hmm. I'm gonna save this. Save as first four point three six. I can use a point in a name. Compiling. Whoa, what a night, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, it was a very interesting night, but at the end, I mean, most of us lived. Yeah. As I said, it was a great time, great practice for me, especially the refueling. I haven't uh, done uh, asymmetrical I'm... turning at the same time, so that was fun. Yeah, I had one AMRAM left on the on the uh, end on the right side. Yeah, I only used station. two, so yeah. I, had like, I had, only used like three, so I only had like three AMRAMs. I'm sorry, number three, because I sent you to uh, steer point six, and I, I didn't tell you exactly what to do. I expected, you know, for you to. Oh, just... I, was, I was covering the area, but I think it turned away too soon. Right. Ooh, well, let's, uh, that was a long mission, and we still ended up somewhat early for some of us. But when it comes to normal missions, usually we just we just now be getting to debrief or something on a normal mission. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, okay. it's yeah. crazy sometimes. I'm fine with that. But yes, thanks for coming, everyone, and uh, being patient with this new update and the uh, uh, craziness that in ensued. Yeah, once again, thanks for uh, setting this up. It was, as I said, a great mission. Yeah, it has problems, but you know, it's more BMS than any of us really. Yeah, no, absolutely. And goodness, took uh, what, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday.